Hi everyone, it's Alona and it's time for a new quick tutorial. And in this tutorial we will turn 2D photo to 3D photo. Yeah, I know, everyone loves uh, fake 3D in After Effects, me too, you're not alone. And in this uh, tutorial we won't use any plugins or effects, uh, we'll use just standard tools. Sounds cool? I hope so. And actually, I hope that you ignore my <laughs> sexy voice. Uh, yeah, I got a cold recently, uh, so please don't pay attention. Uh, but I just can't leave you without content, you know, and can't leave this channel without content. So yeah, that's the reason why I'm here. And before we start, uh, I remind you, as always, that you can follow me in Instagram, where we have very cozy community and atmosphere. I answer your questions, your DMs, uh, your uh, you know any comments. Uh, so yeah, a lot of content there. Uh, so I'm waiting for you. Well, it's time to explain everything and explain the workflow and how we will do this uh, very nice effect. Firstly, find the photo that you want to animate. I have this very nice dog because I'm going to get a puppy, so yeah, the reason is pretty obvious. And then we will draw a map for the depths. How to do it? I will use a Photoshop, but you can use any other tools where you have just brush uh, tool and uh, just a feather for this brush. But how to do it? How to draw this map. We have to imagine what parts of the photo are closer to the camera and make them brighter. For example, the nose is the closest part uh, of this photo uh, based on my example. And that's why uh, this part I made very bright, as you can see. And then don't forget about parts that uh, are further from the camera and make them darker. That's why I made spine and ears uh, darker. I used very dark gray color for them. And that's it. It's the main principle. And uh, as I said before, you can use any tool that you like. I used Photoshop and please ignore my Russian interface face and uh, now I will show you the drawing process how I created this map Okay, the map is almost done. Uh, I don't worry that uh, you know the borders uh, of the um, of the dock is very sharp, just because I can add a blur effect in After Effects later and control it. So save it as a PNG file and let's go to After Effects. In After Effects, I imported two pictures. Uh, it's uh, the photo and uh, the map move them to the composition and apply fast blur effect to the map. And using this effect we'll control uh, the blending between shades. After that move this layer to the precompose. And here to the main photo I applied a new effect, uh, it's displacement map. And uh, don't forget to change uh, the mode. 
we will use luminance mode and of course apply your map your pre-compose that you prepared before use it uh, as a map for the displacement and now you can play with the parameters and get very nice uh, fake 3d effect uh, for your photo but don't use uh, extremely high value for the parameters uh, uh, to avoid uh, the issues with the distortions But as you can see, we have a very strange uh, distortion for the ears and how to, how to fix it. Uh, firstly, I changed uh, the radius for the fast blur. But it seems uh, it didn't help a lot, so I decided to make uh, the ears a bit darker in Photoshop and then just save the new version of the map. Yay, finally it works uh, and uh, now it's time for your creativity. You can experiment with map, you can experiment with displacement, with parameters. So yeah, everything depends on your ideas uh, and I will be extremely happy to see your results. So you can mention me uh, in Instagram and I always, always watch everything and repost everything. And if you enjoyed this tutorial, you can hit a like and drop a comment uh, and of course subscribe on this channel. It's extremely important for me as a creator or join to my patrons. Thanks guys, you're incredible. I appreciate so much your support uh, and my patrons have access to all project files from from the tutorials. And also I remind you about the class on Udemy, about advanced characteristic and all links uh, as always are in the description of this video. Whoa, finally I finished! Thanks for your time guys and see you in the next video!